Hey TikTok, welcome or welcome back to Crystalline's Crystal Clear Visions, where I like to use my vision, tarot, oracle, music, movies, dreams, whatever, to get us messages from the most high, from our angels, from our ancestors, from our guides, and of course from our loved ones who are here as well as past over. They like to bring us messages of encouragement. They like to help us get past any blockages, and I'm going to keep it a buck, y'all, sometimes. They like to let us be a little nosy. So I thank you guys so very much for being here. I thank you for your likes, your shares, your subscriptions to the channel, your follows on the channel, and your comments. I appreciate you guys so very much for all y'all do to help me to grow. If you should happen to be new here, welcome, welcome, welcome. I hope you find this content to be enjoyable. I hope I'm able to tickle your fancy. All I ask in return is if I'm checking off that box for you, is that you hit that like button for me, share the video, follow the channel, and just, you know, interact, okay? I appreciate you guys so very much. I do have to preface these videos by saying that they are for entertainment and educational purposes only, so please, let's use discernment as we check out these readings. I'm not liable for the fade that you catch from my interpretation of the illustrations on these cards. Also, these are general messages, so take what resonates. Leave what doesn't. This isn't going to be everybody's story. And last but certainly not least, please do not um, <clears throat> do not use this as legal or medical advice because I hold no license in those areas, okay? So that said, and out the way, let's get into it. Bottom of the deck, this is my law and order deck, so these are more geared towards crimes, okay? So we got white at the bottom of the deck. We got a red rum here. We got parole, a restraining order, we have a tarot reader, we have a domestic dispute, something couldn't have taken place in a parking lot, we have defamation of character, we have a Schmex offender, a 380 pistol, malice. Head in a dark magician, all right? So we have a tarot reader out here, a dark magician. This is a situation with someone being unalive, okay? Um, someone could have been shot in the head. Um, <clears throat> but let's see what more information we can get here, okay? White is one of those colors that it encompasses all colors it's usually um usually when you see people wearing white it's one of those colors that um it deflects negative energy it's also one of those colors that when they are doing rituals or things of that nature you tend to see um people wearing white as well so let's see what's going on here we got someone just threw a drink in your face, mad. So someone here is feeling disrespected, okay? They was ready to fight. We do have this domestic dispute here. Someone threw a drink in someone's face. It says you're at a high school reunion and no one remembers you. So somebody here felt disrespected. Somebody here felt unseen and they were sad. We got happy. You just won a marathon. So this seems like it could have been some sort of gathering, party, something to that extent that may have kind of gotten out of hand, okay? Somebody, you know, somebody here was feeling like not noticed, sad, okay, forgotten, while someone else here was feeling disrespected at this party. It says scared. You just insulted someone much bigger than you. They're waiting for your reaction or you're waiting for their reaction. So... Um, this definitely could be a couple of different scenarios as well. I'm feeling like someone, um, definitely could have, um, like pick someone out for a certain situation as far as they preyed upon someone here who may have been a kind of feeling sad because maybe nobody noticed them. Um, no one was paying attention to them. And so this was the per perfect person to, um, maybe make disappear, okay? Um, someone definitely had um, some sort of malicious intent. 
um, at this party. So it was like as, it's as if someone was praying on someone here and they prayed on someone that was kind of having low self-esteem because this person felt like they kind of blended in. Now, there could have been a situation where there was some sort of argument that broke out here. Someone here um, could have, it, this could have been an argument that was on purpose, like it was purposefully staged here, okay, um, and then there, this is a situation where it could have been um, just the person in the wrong place, um, but let's see what else comes out. We got underneath the deck, you wish you weren't spending another Saturday night at home with your cat, so yeah, somebody here definitely um, spends a lot of time alone, um, so that's why this person was possibly like the prime example or the the prime target in this situation i'm getting like somebody who when they prey on people and they they prey on the person that doesn't have a lot of family doesn't have a lot of friends um someone that if this person were to go missing not many people would look for this person so i do feel like this was some sort of ritualistic um situation here that took place um and someone prayed on this person but i do feel like it was a setup so there was a setup to make it look as though there was some sort of argument um yeah they made it look like it was some sort of argument and then you know took someone out as a form of um sacrifice <laughs> sorry <laughs> over here about to fall over we got focus so yeah someone was definitely watching someone praying on someone okay they um was watching someone from a fake profile or somebody was trying to figure out a way to get some sort of access to someone here they could have used this person under the guise of love with this domestic dispute here so it's like someone you know prayed on a person that did not have um, you know, they tried to force some sort of love on this person. They tried to say, hey, you know, it was more of enchantment, though. So they enchanted this person to let down their guard and trust them here. OK, this could have definitely been something that was spontaneous or they wanted to make it look like it was spontaneous. Somebody could have like popped up on someone on surprise as a surprise here. We got magnetic, unexplainable pool, can't resist. So there's some sort of magnetic attraction here. Somebody, um, yeah, this is giving me like someone could have done some sort of love spell to make someone not want to leave. They wanted this person to continue to come back and want more, okay? And we also have unconditional love here. So somebody prayed on someone that um, they knew would have or would show some sort of unconditional love to them. Yes, and we got Archangel Michael here. So um, somebody was somebody was divinely protected so this could have been a situation where someone was trying to set someone up to maybe um take someone here okay maybe this is a ongoing ritual so it had been performed more than once um and so the plan was to maybe get another target maybe the first target that they got they were successful at sacrificing this person and they were going to try and sacrifice another person and they ended up um this didn't work out because this person was divinely protected someone was trying to do some sort of love spell here and this could have backfired here so there definitely was some sort of dark magician that could have been at the head of this and maybe they were trying to do this to a tarot reader because um you know they were maybe trying to sacrifice and get this person's gifts yeah we got theft here so someone's main focus was to try and steal someone's gifts but they were unable to pull this off because, again, this person was divinely protected here. Somebody set up some sort of meeting here to try and steal this person, this tarot reader's gifts. And now this tarot reader is, yeah, we got a rich, good gentleman here. This is somebody who uses their money, their affluence 
um, to cause some sort of endings here. Card number 13. This person is a dark magician. So they use dark magic to lure people in in order to try and, you know, tamper with them. But this didn't go the way this person.